Hey guys and welcome back. In the last part we have started uh, with our animation blueprint. Um, as you can see we can just yeah walk around here or run around or even crouch if we want to. Um, yeah well today we want to add a jumping animation because well this looks yeah really bad and um, maybe even a sprinting animation which is a little bit faster than our current running animation. Um, yeah, to do this, just switch over to Mixamo and in here we can just type in jump. Oh well, uh, first I would like to start with our sprinting animation. Um, <clears throat> okay, we need to reload the site once more. And sprint and in place and this works. Awesome. <laughs> Well, um, maybe we can find another animation because yeah, I really need a uh, in place for it to work. Okay, this is our normal running animation, I think, but we can adjust the speed. Maybe even more and we can adjust the style. Well, okay, this looks pretty funny. Um, maybe take, yeah, let's take around 56, it's okay. Uh, so download it without skin. Okay, and yeah, now we need a jumping animation, so type in jump. This one looks quite good. Um, yeah, I think maybe, okay, no. Um, okay, no, I don't like this, um, maybe this one, okay, that's even better, uh, so, yeah, let's download it without skin. Now I have imported both of them, if we take a look into our sprinting animation, we can see that he is way faster than in our running animation, and here's our jumping animation, which looks good too. Um, okay, let's start with opening up our blend space and in here we want to select the sprinting animation and drag it near the end and well, um, okay, that's our um, idling animation, a normal um, walking animation and here's our running animation and our sprinting animation. Um, well, okay, I think this should work. So save it. And now we have this jumping animation over here. Um, well, okay, we do need three animations. So simply duplicate it um, and once more. And well, okay. Now if we yeah, just would rename one, we should call it uh, jump start and the other one jump loop and not the uh, last one jump end. Okay, for jump start we want to maybe, yeah, maybe we want to uh, remove those frames here and Maybe we want to remove those frames. And now we just have a jump start animation. Um, okay, same for jump loop. But in here we just want to have... Yeah, maybe somewhere around here. Just I uh, want to have this one single frame. So yeah, that's it. And jump end. Okay, we want to remove them. And when we hit the ground, we want to yeah, remove the other frames. Okay, great. So, okay, no hide the toolbar. Now we have uh, those three animations and we can start building our anim blueprint. Um, well, 
where do we have it here okay um, so create a new state and name it jump start um, and this one well uh, jump loop and the last one um, jump end okay now we want to start jumping uh, when our character well is jumping so drag out the boolean is jumping when our uh, jump start animation uh, is not playing anymore so just uh, right click and type in jump start well okay now we just need to um, we just need to wire our jump start animation here up okay and now we can right click and say jump start time remaining um, well is less than maybe this one should work um, okay then we want to play jump loop and if we are not jumping anymore or just say not falling and not jumping oh well we could no okay this should work uh, not falling and not jumping um yeah then we want to play jump end and when jump end is not playing anymore we want to call um yeah our normal idle slash walk slash run state again so right click and jump end less than 03 okay and connect them and now when we say is jumping okay it works quite good except for uh, the jump end I think the um, value needs to be a little bit higher maybe so well no not really maybe with uh, maybe three six well this looks okay last try away okay no not let's try and maybe change it to three nine okay three nine looks good um, we can change a jump start here to three one and now it's jumping okay great um so now okay no uh, we're not setting is jumping so to do this just open up our event graph for now we just uh, leave this value uh, is falling to false but later on we could use it to create a different animation uh, when the character is falling and when the character uh, is jumping um okay but for now we just use a uh, jumping sr um, in a uh, variable to do this just yeah get our character movement and is in air uh, or uh, is falling and when he's falling just say that he's jumping and now press play walk around crouch around run around and jump around well um, as you can see uh, the jumping animation itself um yeah it plays a little bit too late and um, to fix this uh, we could do uh, two different things uh, the first thing is open up our um, third person character and where do we have it jump okay take this one and let's say um, okay drag it out a little bit to have a little bit more space and type in delay 
and after a little delay we yeah really want to jump so yeah press space well no okay this does not work uh, so I think the better solution would be to go into our uh, where do we have it jump start okay and maybe remove these frames maybe just these okay and now it works okay now just uh, open up our animation blueprint and now we need to adjust the value here again a little bit maybe three four is jumping well uh, okay yeah sure um, this works nearly as I wanted yeah I think this is okay maybe even three seven and yeah that's it. Um, now we have a, a sprinting animation, or yeah, let's say running animation. But we could adjust the uh, max movement speed when we are when we are sprinting. Maybe we could just use a uh, 900 for now. And yeah, as you see, he's running really, really fast. But even a little bit too slow for 100. Um, maybe thousand would be better or well yeah a little bit more um, maybe thousand would be even too much but let's test it uh, one thousand and now it looks better um, maybe, where do we have it here, our third person character, change this to 1000 and yeah, it definitely was better to change it uh, to 1000. Okay, now we can jump and we can run, we can crouch, whatever. Uh, okay, I think uh, that's it for the uh, third part. And yeah, we will see you again in the next part, so stay tuned and see you soon.